I just wanted to make this video. I want to make a quick video. And I, I don't even post videos like that anymore. But um, today is laundry day. How you know it's laundry day? I got the laundry day camera. I mean, candle up. Yeah, that's it right there. So, <laughs> with laundry day, I typically do um a, a bunch of chores. I take care of, like, you know, things. Like, try to keep up with my looks. Try to keep my looks up there. Cause my looks, I just be, like, letting that slip all the way. And I just try to, like, do my clothes and, you know, just take care of things. Because things can kind of get overwhelming when you're living alone, right? As you can see right there. I got like clothes to fold and stuff like that. And um, I wanted to kind of make a video because um, I wanted to touch on something that is kind of, um, I feel like it's kind of bothering. And I just feel like it needs to be shared like because I wanted to know if there are other people who can relate to this and feel the same. So now you're wondering, all right, what is it, right? Well, Let's just dive straight in it. You've heard or you've seen signs that say um, caution, right? Or a sign I would say approach with caution, right? What does that mean, right? Well, approach with caution, caution is practically, um, it's, it's saying to approach when you come towards something be aware and mindful of the surroundings because it's very, it can be dangerous. It's not saying that it, it may be dangerous at the moment, but it can be possibly a dangerous thing. You're approaching um, a lion's cage, you know, approach with conscience. Like, you know, you don't know what type of time that lion, you know, he might try to leap, go, go through the thing and grab you and, and whatever, right? Approach with conscience, that's just, you know, whatever. So um, I seen, um, I seen, actually someone posts on their page approach with caution caution right and that was kind of like overwhelming because it's just like hmm okay as people right i would like to believe that we have grown right we're these we're not the same you know cavemen right we 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 we've grown some of us as people who are able to live amongst each other right and be civilized right we're civilized people so um i'm pretty sure we all are we all live in you know we all live amongst each other however so what can a person mean by approach with caution right well possibly they mean as far as dating them right and the things that um or just getting to know them and just the things that they faced in their life. And it's like, you know, I, I've been through things. I have trauma. I have pain. I think I'm going through. So when you come to me, come with me with caution because um, I can easily go from zero to 100 and things can get ugly. I, I just can't. I just can't. It, these type of things that people post is just... It's just mind blowing and it shows, I think, I think what we all need to do. And I know there's a lot of people who don't really um, post as much or they delete their posts, but take a time, right? Take time to look at your post from your, your page from the beginning and what you post and what you said from when you first opened your page to the very latest, earliest one. And think about where you were, where your mindset was, right? And then think about what your mindset is now. We grow, we grow, we become better people. And I just think that that's what it is. But a lot of people don't have that ability. A lot of people don't grow. A lot of people take in things and they stay stagnant. And when they stay stagnant, they come in and they pass on these bad things to others. And I think that is just not good at all. And honestly, like, I don't understand this terminology that hurt people hurt people, but it shouldn't be something that's like being embraced. I don't think anyone should say, oh, when you approach me, come with caution. Like you shouldn't be endangering anyone. And if you are an endangerment to others, I feel that you should honestly seek 
help, counseling, therapy, um, just anything in that sort because I'm, I'm a, we're about better than each other. I feel like social media is a platform that can be used for good and bad, but I want to see the good outshine the bad, and people like to sell that they're like this good people or whatever case like that, but you know, it's about uplifting one another, uplifting each other, you know, like certain things is important. So, um, I think anyone, this message to anyone who feels like people need to approach them with caution, I feel like you need to be mindful of others and being that you went through so much pain and trauma, which I'm terribly sorry for, doesn't mean you should give you a right to put others. I feel like you should learn from it. You should grow, be a better person and know how to avoid people who are damaging you and put yourself around people who can enable you and build you. Simple, but um, yeah. The only things I should be saying approach with caution is construction sites <laughs> and line gates. <laughs>